Each violent countenance of Cerberus agrees the Sator Sack must be destroyed. See you, boy. Out of my damn way. She was the queen. Queen of the Underworld, my queen. Commanding reverence and awe and fear. She was not just, what was the term you used? A consolation prize. You are as disrespectful to her as you are to me. Oh, what would you even know? You claim so much respect for her, yet you didn't even respect her enough to tell her what happened after she left. But what am I saying? I know you love her still, father. That best explains all the terrible choices you've made. All the terrible choices I've made. By the time you have existed for as long as I have, pray you will have made fewer. Although I fear you shall surpass me in at least this one regard. This again. Your chance. 
class to you, boy. You think you are superior to me? You are a fool. Blast. You. See you at home. In the name of someone very sore right now. to see this each day. You're back? Mother! You can't do this to me, Mother. You said Father is no fool, and neither are you. There has to be a way to fix this. Not just with you and Father, but with everyone. There has to be a way. You have your father's stubbornness. Listen to me. You're endangering everything you care about by coming here. Don't you understand? Besides... What? Besides what? Tell me, please. The truth is that I like it here, Zagreus. I have done well for myself on my own. And your father, he has his domain to look after. The feelings he once had for me, feelings we shared, they fade with time. You'll understand someday. No, I won't be understanding anything of the sort. Father still loves you, I'm sure of it. And he owes you an apology, damn it. I cannot make amends with you on his behalf. Something only you can do together. What do you mean he still loves me, Zagreus? How would you know? Because uh, I'm his blasted son, that's how I know. But trust me isn't ever good enough, I know that too. I'll prove it to you, Mother. Just you wait and see. Oh, you're fading, son. You don't need to prove anything to me. Please don't do anything rash. All of us made our choices. Now we have to live with them. Isn't it enough to know that I'm safe? That I'm content to be alone? No. Uh, it's not... It's not enough for me, because this blasted family... It cannot just keep hiding from its problems. Running from them. We're stuck with one another. We... we have to do everything we can for one another. I... Oh, my dear boy. We... have to. No, not... yet. God damn it all. Again. They won't catch me sleeping on the job again. Achilles, I need your help. What is it, lad? What's wrong? What can I do? Let me in Father's chambers, please. That's high atop the list of things I'm not to do for anyone and under any circumstances. What is it you need? I've never even been in there myself. I don't know. I don't know. But if I know Father, and I think I do, he's got to have something of hers in there, of Mother's. She still doesn't get it, doesn't believe me about him, and I said I'd prove it, that he cares for her. All right, slow down, I understand. Look, this can get me in a lot of trouble like you've no idea. And not just me, so be careful and be quick while he's still out. Take this and go. Don't leave anything there out of place, all right? Thank you. Not here. No, can't go this yes. way just yet. I can't keep bailing you out each time you get in over your head. What news, spirit? Thank you. 
the stoic lord and master of the house, possesses wealth beyond imagining, a portion of which he has used for a crisp set of attire for every passing day. I knew it. It's just capes. In his Lord Father's very private chambers, Zagreus, the lock-removing prince, discovers a most delicately painted likeness of none other than Persephone herself. A coat of dust suggests it has remained here for some time. He's never stopped thinking of her. Oh, what a fool. Find what you need. I did, thank you. Hi, Prince. I fed Cerberus already. All three heads. Good seeing you. There must be some mistake. Hi, Prince. You're giving this to me? I want you to know we all appreciate you, Dusa. Don't work yourself too hard on my account, okay? Oh, Orpheus, I heard from Hermes, messenger and god of travel and all that. It's odd I'm giving you his message in this case, but he says hey. Admires your musical ability as well. Oh, that was kind of him, my friend. When I first ventured deep into this realm, while searching for the soul of my lost muse, after I failed utterly, it was Lord Hermes who whisked her away. It happened so fast. He did an excellent job. I'm glad you took it so well. Nyx, you've known Megara practically forever. Well, before my time, at least. So could you... Tell me more about what she was like back then. I am pleased to see the two of you on better terms of late. Megara always was as she appears. Dutiful and quite particular. Thoughtful and dependable. Respectful. Respectful. Definitely. you some more of that contraband you like. Don't suppose I could help you put it away or anything? Look at me, Zack. You think that all these gifts will make things go back to the way they were? They won't. It isn't possible. We may be immortals, but we're older now. I'd hope we're wiser, too. You can have these, Chef. Till next time. Need more of those, so here. Skelly. 